welcome to Red Kite View, the new home for inpatient services for young people across West Yorkshire, referred to us by the Children and Young People's Mental Health Service, known as CAMS in some areas. We've made the short film to give you an idea of what this new building is like, and what you and your parents or carers can expect from the service and the people who will care for you. It's deliberately short because there is a huge amount of information to read on the Red Kite View website. All the people you see are volunteer actors, including the young man being admitted today with his parents. We are calling him Jack. We are calling the young female inpatient, Emily. Here we see Jack being welcomed into Red Kite View and settling into his new bedroom. All our bedrooms have study desks, plenty of storage space and ensuite bathroom facilities like this one. Meanwhile, his parents have a chat to a member of staff to discuss the visits they can make and any other issues they may have such as schoolwork, food and the daily timetable. Staff introduce Jack to other young people in one of the outdoor courtyards. It's important service users are helped to settle in and socialise and enjoy relaxing activities such as a game of cards. At weekends, trips out might be arranged to the cinema or arts and crafts sessions, baking or mindfulness and relaxation groups. Mental health nurses hold a therapy session with service user Emily as part of her treatment plan, which includes therapy and rehabilitation activities. Some of this takes place in the multi-sensory room you see here. During your stay, you will have a care plan and timetable. These will be regularly reviewed and updated. In the early part of your admission, you and your family or carers will meet your care team to discuss your time on the ward, your care and progress. You will also meet the therapy team to discuss your needs, including individual and group therapies. Our specialist dietitian is working with Emily in the therapy kitchen, where young people are helped with developing independence. The catering team are dedicated to creating the most tempting and healthy food possible for Red Kite View's young people. They aim to understand the difficulties young people face. Some find the smell, tastes, textures and colours of food a challenge. The team will work with the young person and their parents or carers to manage that. Keeping up with your education is really important and school sessions take place in the Starling Suite where a dedicated and enthusiastic team work with you and your school or other learning providers to ensure you don't fall behind or miss vital exams. Specialist learning mentors and higher level teaching assistants facilitate a wide range of opportunities including post-16 options. They also have a pastoral role, providing support when people go back to an education setting when they leave Red Kite View. Each room has Wi-Fi and you get a password for it. It's great that you can sit quietly in your own room to get on with some studying and the teachers will keep in touch with your own school or whatever course you want to do. Or you can just chill. To put it in a nutshell, there's a great team waiting to greet you at Red Kite View. The kitchens offer a fantastic choice of food. The bedrooms give you your own space. Or you can relax with others. Lessons can be fun at Red Kite View. Staff really listen to you. There are lots of different treatments to help you. You're close to the heart of Leeds. But you're also in a wooded setting. And there's always a smile at Red Kite View. Bert, we don't want you to stay with us for a long time. We want to help you receive the best possible care in the shortest possible time so that you can return to the community and the environment where you will thrive. Please don't ever be afraid to ask for help and information about Red Kite View. Our thanks are due to all the volunteer actors who gave us their time so generously. <laughs>